Hello everyone and welcome back to my second channel. So I've decided that I want to do a week in my life since it's been a little while since I've done one of those. I've been mainly just doing kind of like the mini vlogs and travel vlogs but I'm back home for the month of April so I thought why not show you guys what the weeks are like when I'm actually home and not traveling with my boyfriend or doing something extravagant like that but i do still have some fun plans this week as you can see i desperately need my nails done like oh my gosh how bad is that i cut them all off yesterday because fun fact i well i got in last night and when i was at the airport um i fell up some concrete stairs and smashed my nails <laughs> So they broke off, so that really hurt. So I'm going to go get those done probably tomorrow. And then my friend is sleeping over um, on Tuesday, I think. Right now it's Thursday, so I'll have some girl time as well. And I'm actually just about to head out to the grocery store and grab some stuff since I've been away. So just some fun standard errands as well as catching up on work. Today I'm not really doing any work because I just have to get sorted um coming back like going grocery shopping and i also just finished cleaning the house for my mom because she's been so stressed so little things like that since i'm back i want to try and get back into the healthy routine that i had because before i left to the uk i wasn't vlogging it but i really should have i was eating so healthy and i was working out every day and i just felt so good and energized and motivated but when I'm in England, all I want to do is eat gravy and curry sauce. And I did a lot of that with his family. And although I do love that, um, it really did leave me feeling tired and just exhausted. And with me being back and having to get back into the routine and swing of things, filming and whatnot, I really need to jump back on my health bandwagon that I was on because I really was feeling so amazing. And I'm very excited because I came back to a new Magic Mind package. I've talked about them before, but I finished up all of my other Magic Mind productivity shots before I left, um, which is probably why I was very unproductive in the UK and just laid in bed all day and only got out for curry sauce. <laughs> so I'm excited to get back into the swing of things, but I'll share with you guys. Uh, let me just go grab the box and I'll show you guys um, the Magic Mind shots. Here is what your package looks like when you order from Magic Mind. I do love the packaging because it's adorable in your fridge. Drink daily for a sharper mind, steady energy and less stress, flow state of view, just oh, very ocean themed like my name. But Magic Mind is a mental performance shot. So this is what the packaging looks like. And then here are the adorable little bottles. These are perfect for if you're on the go and very busy, you can just grab one of these and pop it in your purse um, or in your car to drink later. Or for me, I just take one of these usually upstairs. I would take one upstairs like halfway through the day when I was filming because I always get really tired around like 1 p.m. So I would have a boost of these for filming. Right now it's only 10.22, so I'm gonna save this for after I go to the grocery store because I know I'm gonna be just so tired and jet lagged after that. But I'm going to be starting the seven day magic mind challenge to see just how magic my mind is after taking one of the mental performance shots each day, seven days in a row. And I'll tell you guys how I feel after. Eros just came in. He's like, you've been filming for all of five minutes, so I need attention now. But since Magic Mind is not caffeine heavy, you could also take these at night and not have to worry about sleep. Now inside, you've got Nootropics for Focus, Matcha for Energy. They also use the highest quality grade matcha from Japan. My mom loves matcha. She loves these. There's also adaptogens for less stress, which is what I need, and vitamins for immunity. I'm not too much into science, but if you are, Magic Mind also has nano encapsulation technology, which basically means it's more bioabsorbable by the body than powders or pills, which is really great. It's faster activating, which is probably why I love it so much, taking it midday for that quick boost of energy that I need so that I can get right back into filming. So yeah, I just got back. So I'm going to pop these into the fridge since I just opened the 
package so i'm gonna pop those in because i prefer them cold you can have them like iced with oat milk or usually i just drink them so i'm pop these into the fridge and then i'm going to probably head out to whole foods right now it's like the fancy grocery store but i'm really looking for a good chai concentrate because i'm all out so i'm gonna do that and then i might stop by winners and grab some uh doggy toys for arrow since he always needs love we also got a new puppy well i didn't my mom did um so we have that pup right now he's getting crate trained i think think right i think that's what you call it great trained or kennel trained um so i might include some clips of him but he's just a little baby so i'm also gonna look for some toys for him and yeah that is the plan like i clean the houses i love when i wipe down the counters and everything looks so nice oh my gosh look at there's depression baby you're fine i'm just going to the grocery store and i'm also gonna get you a toy so you should be very excited say hi say hi everyone hi from arrows Oh, she just looks so sad. <laughs> I'll be back. Okay, so I'm at. Okay, let's move that. I'm at the mall now. I'm gonna grab some toys for the pups. I forgot to go to my mailbox, and I have to go all the way back up the highway and go um get mail or whatever. But anyways, I want to show you guys what I got at the grocery store because I've never really like actually been in a Whole Foods. I've only been to the bakery at a Whole Foods, but it is like an entire grocery store for vegans it is so cool there's so much plant-based stuff mind you it was insanely expensive and i probably wouldn't be able to go that often but it was so fun to look at everything so first up i got a mango smoothie because i was just so thirsty and then i got some organic sweet baby lettuce greens there's like spinach and stuff in there my plan for meals the next couple nights while i'm at my parents is to do almost like the mexican barbecue style salad so that's why i got the lettuce and then to go with that i got some marinated baby beets um white wine balsamic was not my flavor of choice necessarily but it was either that or vinegar so beets then i got the star of the show the chefu tofu i've never tried this tofu so i was excited to try it it's barbecue flavored and they recommended for the recipe to do like hawaiian barbecue bites with pineapple and avocado and stuff so then because of that recommendation i got some pineapple mango salsa which was nine dollars which is very pricey but um i thought it would be really yummy and healthy so i got that and then i'll probably do all of that maybe with like some rice and then i got some mochi because it's so hard to find vegan mochi and i've never tried this kind you know it's all sorts of vegan mochi so i got some strawberry ones then i tried i got these to try because it just looks so cool so this is rainbow roll plant-based sushi with plant-based tuna and mango and everything that's what they look like there that doesn't look too appetizing but that does <laughs> so i'm really excited to try this it says award-winning and then they didn't have the chai concentrate that i'm looking for i think the only way i can get it is to order it so i'll have to order it at some point but i'll try this kind this is the say when dirty chai i've tried the say when golden chai and i don't like it so i don't know if how, i don't know if i like this kind or not but i don't know we'll see and then i just got some oat milk this is two bears original oat milk it was on sale i picked the one that was on sale so yeah that's everything that i got from whole foods okay it's voiceover ocean time you might hear arrows snoring in the background but this was me shopping i just went to winners and home sense and let me tell you they had the absolute best stuff that i have seen from them in a while first up they had these polar boxes and i was actually so excited because polar box liked one of my instagram photos so it was really random but i loved their coolers i would totally want to do a photo shoot with them and then all of the spring dishware was just so freaking adorable had i not been planning to move to the uk i definitely would have splurged and bought a new kitchen collection but i just can't take all of that stuff overseas and even the little cherry towels like everything was just so cute i also really wanted this bathrobe with the lace oh my goodness like i've never even seen a bathrobe like that it was just so coquette cottage core with my name on it but it was 50 dollars, so i didn't get it then i had my magic mind shot and i tried to do the oat latte like they recommended although i think i do just like drinking it 
as it is but it really was pretty good with the latte but i don't think i'd like it warm i would definitely have it iced again and then i wanted to try the chai that i got however it was not good i definitely had to buy a different kind it was the say when regular chai it was off amazon that's the one i usually get walked arrows and then i made the salad i was telling you guys about and it was delicious and i enjoyed some housewives good morning everyone so yesterday i just did voiceover but today it is friday we've got a very grumpy sleepy arrows hello who did not sleep on his bed last night so now my bed is all muddy i have to change the sheets which is frustrating so it's a whole point of me buying him that expensive bed you want to say hi say hello i'm very muddy very muddy but very cute nail place just called me and they asked me to come 30 minutes earlier so i have to leave like now um but i just want to show you guys really quickly some products that i've been using and by using i mean i started yesterday but i thought with the whole magic mind inner health kick i also want to try like an outer health kick for the week so i'm trying some new skincare that i got sent from good molecules this um i got sent a while ago but i just haven't tried it because i was traveling and stuff so i thought why not so they sent me first up the niacinamide brightening toner and this i do think i like just from last night i like the way it feels on my skin and I like the way it smells and everything. Some toners really make me nauseous. So that one I like so far. And then they also sent me some hyaluronic acid serum, which is supposed to be really good for plumping fine lines. This one I also like the feel of because it doesn't feel greasy. Their Yerba Mate Wake Up Eye Gel. This, I don't, I don't know. I think I like it. I've never really used an eye cream. And then this is the Lightweight Daily Moisturizer. But this is formulated with shea butter, avocado seed oil, and hyaluronic acid. And this, I didn't like the way it felt on my skin just because it felt quite greasy. And that was because of the shea butter and avocado oils. Quickly um, throw on an outfit and go get my nails done. And then I have to go to the post office and get some mail and whatnot. But I will be sure to see you guys later. Okay, now I'm back at home and here are what my nails look like. They're much shorter than I wanted. We, I didn't realize how much they get like really filed down actually so they're pretty short right now but I did a cute little cherry for spring and they're yellow. I don't love how short they are because I feel like my nails look like like chunky but um, it's probably just because I'm not used to the length either. And at least this way they won't snap off if I fall down some concrete stairs or up some concrete stairs like I normally do. So I got my nails done and then I went and picked up my mail slips and now I'm back at home so I'll probably just do work for a while but I am feeling quite already on it. I'm feeling quite tired just from the drive and it's starting to snow as well. So I'm probably gonna take my Magic Mind um, productivity shot earlier than usual because it's only like noon now and normally i'd wait until like two to take it. but at least i have some fresh nails that aren't all broken off me again here's me cuddling the pup little, little baby papa amoro and then i had my magic mine shot for the day for that boost of energy hello everyone so it is day three of my week in life uh it is currently what day is it even it's saturday and it's been such a busy day i got up and i ran out of the house to go meet my mom on a dog walk and then i went straight from there to take my brother to gymnastics and actually one of his gymnastics coaches is a fan of my asmr channel so i got to meet her which was really sweet and she's adorable although i looked like this so i wished i looked a little bit more presentable and then i came um, home after the gymnastics and I've just been trying to do work because last night I wanted to do work and then I passed out I was so tired at like 10 p.m. So I was just getting a bit of work done now I'm just working on some campaigns just for like photo shoots and whatnot And I'm also prepping for my clothing line campaign, which is at the end of the month for my new collection I'm gonna do a separate video on that, but I'm really excited and so now it is about 3.30. I need to feed the puppy and 
then after that I need to take Eros on a walk and then after that I have a FaceTime date with my boyfriend and then I'm gonna do some more work so not anything too spectacular. Day three of the Magic Mind seven day challenge. Your girl is feeling better already and I did a little part cleanup so happy days. Hello everyone so I just got back to my apartment and funny enough there was a notice on my door not an eviction notice this time if you know that story but a notice saying that fire alarms are going to be sounding periodically tomorrow they're doing testing on the whole building so not going to be able to film which is frustrating because i've been wanting to film for a few days now so i might just uh, i don't know go to my parents house and just do like some non-filming work or go to a coffee shop and work because i know if i'm here with the fire alarms i'll go crazy so i'm gonna unpack and then i'll give you guys a little mini tour of my apartment because i got some new furniture and then i have a facetime date with my boyfriend soon so i'm excited about that little update of my apartment she's looking she's looking gorgeous i mean i love the picture with the two sconces there i love my new couch i just bought these two pink pillows so yesterday or the day before to go on my couch with the little circle one and this green blanket i still have this massive this is like a full king size blanket but I, I don't know i'll just keep it there but i love the green i have my room divider that i got off facebook marketplace again the very pretty gold frame pictures i've got my trunks and then in this little corner i have some more vintagey style photos there you can see a bit better the vintage vase and everything i still oh what an outfit that is <laughs> i still have to paint this uh mirror because it's like it's dark it's it's black and i want it to be kind of a creamy pink color i think but the thing is is it's wood but like plastic wood i'm not too sure how i'm gonna i don't know if i have to like sand it down first but i do want to paint that at some point and clean it all up get the stickers off and everything but I'm so excited to have it painted so then I can take cute little selfies, outfit of the days in here. And then I can move this, the uh, room divider behind me so that I've got a nice little background. And then you guys have basically seen the rest of the kitchen and everything. So nothing too special else that's going on. Ex oh, except for my, my boyfriend's giant monitor that he got last time he was here. So now I have this in the kitchen. To uh, FaceTime my boyfriend soon, unpack. And that's about it for today. And then I guess tomorrow, I don't know, I'm gonna have to go somewhere else and do work because of the alarm testing. But other than that, not too much more for tonight, just unpacking. So I'll see you guys later. So I wanted to share with you my little snack that I've been loving, had my magic mind shot, and then some of this tabbouleh with mango pineapple salsa that I got earlier and the little nans, so delicious. And then I had to pack some orders. Someone ordered the Italia Triangle Bikini. I love this one. And look at my new business cards, little cards you get with your order. I'm so proud of them. I designed them myself. So cute. Hello, everyone. So it is day four of the week in my life. And today was such a busy day because I didn't realize it, but it was Eros's birthday. So Eros turned three. So I honestly spent probably like two hours straight with him. We went on a really long walk. Um, I took him to his favorite parks and I took him to the beach and all of that fun stuff. So he had a really great day. And then my mom had a pro DJ from school because she's a teacher. So then once she was off early from her pro D, it was actually the eclipse. So that happened, but I was inside with the two dogs. So I didn't really see it. Um, it doesn't really interest me as much, but a lot of people were out and about at the parks and everything because it was a big deal anyways though um she came home and then we went to the store and we got arrow some birthday presents and toys and boned i got some more stuff for my apartment well just two little things and i got some stuff for danny my best friend um she and i are having a sleepover i mentioned this to you guys but i'm not sure if i mentioned already she got accepted into acting school in paris how cool is that so i wanted to just get her a little something to like celebrate her getting into school because i'm so proud of her um and that she she goes in september so not looking forward to my best friend leaving but at least if i'm visiting my boyfriend in the uk a lot i could do girls trips to france hopefully and visit her um so yeah i'll show you guys what i got her and what i got for my apartment but i just got back to my apartment so i want to take my 
magic mind shot as well because your girl is exhausted from running around with dogs all day. I got these two adorable little mushrooms from HomeSense. Now I will say that because I got these after, the greens don't match perfectly. You can see like, I mean, they're not, they're not too bad actually. This one is just a bit more warm toned and these are cool toned, but it really doesn't bug me that much because I think it's just so adorable and this isn't really a big space. So I didn't want a big ottoman here, a coffee table I realized because I just thought it'd be too crowded with also the stools because when you look at the space, like it's not that much room here to get by to go to the stairs and to use the stools. So I just wanted these and now I can sit on my couch comfortably, put my feet up, edit videos. I love it, it's adorable, how cute. I actually did forget that I got a couple other little things for me, so I'll show you those as well. So first up in here, it was just too cute to pass up, okay? And it was on sale and it's a, it's a business expense. I'm gonna do a strawberry shortcake or very sweet ASMR video for my channel there. So I got these adorable little salt and pepper strawberry shakers. They're like 10 bucks, which I thought was pretty good. And then really what made me do this strawberry themed video idea was I saw that they had this. Are you kidding me? How adorable is that for the video? Like, oh, that's so cute. And then I want to do my makeup, like a little, like, I don't know, strawberry themed. It's going to be adorable. So I got those for a video. And I love doing themed videos with like different props. Like I'm never really mad about spending money. I mean, that was like $20, but I'm never really too mad about spending money on props because I love investing the money into my videos so that I can just feel so proud and excited to film and like get the creative juices flowing. So I'm happy about that purchase. Very happy if I will. And then Danny, I got her just a couple things. So first up, none of it really goes together. Okay. But I was struggling on what to get her because I didn't want to get her something too cheesy for Paris. And then I was like, well, it has to be kind of Paris themed, but then maybe it's better if she's just, if it's just travel themed. And also I love Danny with my whole heart, but it is hard shopping for her because we have such different styles and I don't want to get her something she doesn't like. So I was in there for so long with my mom and I just, anyways, I hope she likes this stuff, but it doesn't really go together. First up, I got her these little luggage um, tag. It's like a luggage tag and a passport holder because she has to fly there. Okay, passport. So that makes sense. And the last time she slept over, I got her this mushroom from HomeSense. It's like this like mushroom decor cushiony thing. And she thought it was adorable. So I was like, let's keep with the mushroom theme. It's cute. I think she'll actually like that. And she loves red. And then I got her this, which is on theme, but I didn't think it was too cheesy because of the colors. Paris notebook for her to write down all her travels or maybe write best friend love letters to me while she's gone. <laughs> these, because I was like, oh my gosh, how iconic are these for just being a, like an actress getting your makeup done, like, oh my gosh. I got her these pajamas. Now these are from Free People, but they were at Winners, so total steal. And look at the pants. She's gonna love these. I just know she's gonna love these with the frills and the deep purpley color. Like, oh, I just know she's gonna love these. I was so excited about these. I can totally see her like sitting in her acting chair, getting her makeup done or whatever. Oh my gosh. And then the, sh the shirt, look how beautiful the top is. Those PJs for her. I'm really excited. I'm excited for our sleepover because I haven't seen her since early March. So it's been a while. We FaceTimed and whatnot, but not the same. And we still have to celebrate my birthday because we didn't celebrate my birthday yet. And we have to celebrate her getting accepted into school. So I got her that little present there. Like I said, it doesn't go together. The deep satin purple pajamas with the notebook and the mushroom luggage tags, but it all has a purpose, <laughs> okay? I'm probably just going to get ready for maybe bed. I'm feeling a little bit tired and I want to get a good start on the day tomorrow because I'm finally back at my apartment and I really want to film. So I'm going to do any prep work that I have to do for filming. Catch up on emails and whatnot. I was doing a lot of emails today, but your girl is always behind on emails. I get so many a day. So just going to do that and then get some good sleep. Maybe watch an episode of Real Housewives before bed because I love that show easy viewing and yeah that is all for today it is currently monday so i will see you guys later
all right day six so today was a full-on filming day i woke up at seven on my own which i was pretty happy about and i just did my makeup and hair and then i filmed three or four video well i ended up filming five videos total that day but it's filmed three in the morning i think and then i ended up having lunch taking my magic mind shot of course almost finishing up the challenge and then filmed some more hello everyone so this is probably going to be the last day of my vlog or i'll vlog a little bit tomorrow morning but my friend is coming over tonight so i'm excited to see danny and give her the presents that i showed you guys i'm in a little bit of a rush though because i woke up and i had to film two videos and last night i got a bunch of packages delivered to my mom's house because i can't get them delivered here anymore because people steal my packages at this apartment which is terrible so i have to go to my mom's house pick up all the packages let the dogs out and play with them for about an hour so that the puppy can go pee and everything and then i have to come back here and film a video with one of the packages film it edit it send it off um i want to film a little bit more <laughs> and then i have to prep for my friend to come over because i wanted to just like prep her present and yeah clean the apartment so a little bit of a rush <laughs> but i will film bits here and there and i also will do an update because today's the last day of the magic mind seven day challenge and your girl is feeling great okay so i'll film a little bit of an update there as well um but i do have to get going to my mom's right now and it's only 11 so I won't take my Magic Mind productivity shot anyways right now because I don't need it yet. I still have morning energy. <laughs> so I'm going to um, go and do that now and then I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, so it is 5, actually like 6.30 p.m. So Danny is coming after 7, so I'll see her soon. But I just did a quick little workout and my energy has been pretty good all day so I'm really happy but I am still going to take my magic mind productivity shot because I don't want to get an energy slouch before my best friend comes over and today is my last day of the seven day challenge so I'm finishing it up but that does not mean I am not going to keep using the magic mind shots because your girl loves them and I'm actually so excited to give Danny a few because I know she's gonna love them as well now being done the seven day challenge, considering it's 6.30 p.m. and I just did a workout and I'm feeling great for energy. I mean, that does say a lot because normally I am pretty tired by now. So taking consistently over seven days has increased my overall productivity and energy levels, especially thinking back to 10 days ago when I was in the UK and taking naps um, all the time. Be I mean, I was eating a lot of gravy and curry sauce, so that does add to it as well. It just goes to show that when I'm not getting the vitamins, adaptogens, and nootropics that I get with Magic Mind, I am just so much more slouchy and tired, and I have way less motivation than now. I filmed already four videos today. I'm going strong. I did a workout. My best friend's gonna come over, so it's been lovely. So I definitely recommend, of course, Magic Mind. It's risk-free. I mean, if you're not satisfied, you get a refund, 100% money back, but I'm sure you will be satisfied. I mean, I love them, my mom loves them, and I'm so excited to share them with Danny when she comes over as well. And also they're a carbon neutral company, so we love that. We love that for the planet and we love that for us. So be sure to check them out. I'll have the links in the description box. So be sure to go to magicmind.com slash OceanaF and use code OceanaF20, which will get you up to 48% off your first subscription for the next 10 days or 20% off a one-time purchase. But overall, your girl is feeling amazing. I also got more samples for my clothing line for the like August collection. So I'm so excited about that. It's my favorite collection to date. I'm so proud of everything. I started tearing up when I was on FaceTime with my boyfriend showing him everything because I'm just so proud and so proud of how far I've come. So I can't wait for Danny to come over so I can show her those pieces as well and get her opinion on some things, give her her present, all of that good stuff. So I'll vlog a bit with her, but I want to spend just a lot of girl time with her since I haven't seen her since before my birthday, like March 15th or whatever it was a long time ago. I will probably just do voiceover or music from here on out. But thank you for joining me on this week in my life. I hope you enjoyed just seeing my everyday. And now I'm happy to be back in my apartment 
and filming again. Yesterday I filmed five videos, today I filmed four. Tomorrow I'll probably film a couple after Danny heads back and I love it, I love filming. It makes me so happy. But I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video, but enjoy the rest. So to finish off, Danny came over and this is the dress she got me for my birthday. I love it. It was really, really sweet of her and she loved everything I got her. So I'm really happy about that. And then the next morning we went for a nice, healthy lunch salad. Love you all so much. See you in the next one.